Hello, it's TGC Requiem. We're here with a new league, Green Black Elves. I am playing what I would right now consider the optimal deck, for me at least, from my experience, of Green Black Elves. Um, mostly because of the sideboard. I pretty much have, have kind of honed in on what I'm looking for. We're on the draw. Um, Actually, I'm kind of okay with this hand. We don't have really any acceleration, unfortunately, but um, I think I'm okay with that. Really what I've kind of come to the conclusion is that we should be on four collected company, three lead the stampede. I think we're playing Jund. Um, so yeah, four collect company, three lead the stampede, and one court of calling is where I feel like we should be. And then I'm assuming this gets bolted. Oh no, so we we're actually playing Living End, which is going to be a little different. A little different than what I was expecting. Yeah, so we definitely play this a little differently. Excuse me. So the thing is, is we want creatures in the graveyard, but we don't really have a way to get them into the graveyard. And so what we need to do is we really need to be in a position for when he goes to Cascade. That we can put some creatures on the battlefield. Or we need to set up a scenario or situation where we can just kind of win on board. Okay, so he's already going after our land.
So we're kind of in this awkward spot where we got to make sure we can keep collected company up. If he taps out on his turn though, then we can be a little more aggressive. So it's possible he has a Simeon Spirit Guide and he's going to cascade after I do this. But I don't think we really have a choice. We can't wait forever. <laughs> yep. So that's probably the Nettle Sentinel. Maybe he kills the Llanowar Elf. Three, six. coming across. Actually, there's really nothing we can do here. That's just game. All right, so we're going to lose that one. We'll be on the play game two. We definitely want to bring in um, Memoricide. Dampy Matrix is probably decent since it at least shuts off Fulminator Mage and any of the other activated abilities they have. Beyond that, I don't know, I mean we could proactively attack their mana base if we think that's a thing. Um, I'm not sure what... I'm just trying to take a quick peek and see what living ends mana base. Like number of lands they play. Nineteen. So I mean it's possible we could go after their mana base. Um, but I feel like we're almost more in a situation where we just want to be as fast as possible and possibly have some inter um, interruption. There's really nothing we can do to get our creatures into the graveyard short of killing our own creatures. So I guess in that regard, Beast Within offers some value to kill our creatures in response. Makes me think we probably cut a cord 
two collected companies. If we're going to go off, we kind of need to go off with lead the stampede. I think we can cut uh, visionary and probably in Missouri. Well, no land's just never going to do it. This is just too slow. Um, even to draw into anything, that's no good. So this at least gives us a fighting chance. Um, we have to go Arch Druid to the bottom. We have to get a, another land. So unfortunately this is just a really tough matchup, but it's also one that's a really small, fairly small percentage of the meta. And so this is just kind of bad luck drawing it. Oh, just trying to get that second land. That's bad news. So we're probably pretty much done here. If we weren't before, that might be the nail in the coffin. I was going to go 5 0 today. I had told myself today is a 5 0 day. Uh, there's almost no way we come back from this. The problem is, is even if we get going here, he's gonna... likely have the ability to cycle again. So we can block and hope he, in response, destroys my land. Yep. Just what a brutal matchup. <laughs> 
So that's game. Even if we draw a land here and we play a Mystic, we can't block enough, so... Well, that's a real bummer. But again, being that that's a smaller percentage of the meta, you know, we do play a Memoricide to try and help against that. And again, we play the... Damping Matrix actually has some value here, but... I mean, if you, if you have to mulligan to five and don't see any of them, you know, it's... It's only so much you can do. So, anywho, I don't know that I would probably... I don't know that the Beast Within was a necessarily great plan. I don't know. It's It, it may have been better to just go for it. Hope to get it like a t turn three win. Um, or be in a position to reload afterwards. So I've definitely played a, against um, Living End before and won via, you know, just being in a position to cast collect a company is and kind of reset my board after they cascade so obviously in this case that didn't work in the first game and you had some mean spirit guide prepared to do that but anywho that's all for now